Hey Jack, you believe in ghosts and visions and stuff like that, don't you? What, you gonna make fun of me too? No, I really need your honest opinion here. Mm, what do you need to know? Well, lately I've been having these visions and I just don't know what to do about them. I don't know what they mean. I figured you could tell me something. Mm, can you explain any of these new uh, visions to me? Well, there's one and kind of looks like it takes place in the past, like medieval times. And there's this guy and he follows the princess. And then there's the second type that I'm having. And but that's a completely different story. It happens in the future and there's a soldier. He just kind of does what he feels is right. He always lurks around in the shadows. And there's also a third one and it's just dark. Well, it's empty, like nothing I've ever felt before. Well, I've never really heard it, heard it put that way before. Um, well, it's late. I'm gonna get to class. See you later. Hey, Sam. Oh, I heard your little conversation with Jack. Listen, those are easily dreams. They mean absolutely nothing. A lot of people have them. But, um... If you're really concerned, I can refer you from this place that helped me when I was having troubles. Hmm. All right, thank you. Take care, Sam. Hey, Sam, I figured out what your visions mean. Nah, Chris already told me what they mean. They're just a bunch of daydreams. They're not just a bunch of daydreams, they're occurring for a reason. You need to figure out what they are. Nah, it's okay. Sam gave me an invitation to this place. God, Sam, look at it again. Tell me what you see. Come on, Jack, it's just an invitation. Ah! Chris is lying to you. Don't listen to him. What I'm trying to do is help him. These are nothing more than hallucinations, dreams. These are more than just hallucinations or dreams. These are something serious that he's having to deal with and you're trying to lie to him and make him I don't have nothing. time to hear you two argue. You're making a mistake, Sam. What do you think you're doing? My job. I'll die before I let you ruin Samuel's life. I should be so lucky. Mind. Did you hear something? No. There will be a time when you will need to protect me. When that time comes, I will need you to be there. I will, my princess. What are you doing here? The knight and the soldier both represent the values of you, Sam. The knight is loyal to his princess, as you are to your values. The soldier 
wants to see justice, as you want to see evil get punished. Both of them represent you, Sam. Why don't you think on that for a bit? Well, you know what? I don't need it. I know who I am.